driving by, you'd have no idea the national significance of this building. It may not look like much. Built in 1962, the Santa Rita Center, once a community center for Sacred Heart Church, has seen better days. Here's, here's an example of, of the movement going on that, and it's obvious <laughs> there's water ponding here, which is con causing this. Preservation architect Jerry so Cook that, is carefully is piecing the seemingly unremarkable building uh, back together. In reinstalling all the windows. One room and 25 days in 1972 that changed the meaning of this building forever. This is the Chavez room. Um, his cot was right here, by the way. Um, and uh, originally there were, when we came in, there were lots of lots of uh, artifacts on the wall that were from his period. Stuff. This is where civil rights activist and United Farm Workers Union leader Cesar Chavez conducted his first hunger strike, a fast for justice for Hispanic laborers, which he called a fast of love. This uh, particular room, uh, you know, it really demonstrates the sacrifice that uh, that Chavez made. Such a humble little room. The city's historic preservation office helps guide developers and building owners when they want to make upgrades or restorations to historic buildings. Uh, in, a, in general, we really encourage folks to reach out to architects who have a background with historic preservation. Not everyone is familiar with um, even just working with the building code and what the building code allows for uh, historic properties. Um, Jerry is very, um, has a very strong background in historic preservation, so him looking at the exact way to reconstruct the roof as it, as it originally was to, to basically recreate uh, what was here historically was really amazing. Chicanos por la Causa owns the building and with the restoration intends on reopening the site for events and celebrations of Hispanic heritage. In this situation with it being a, such a revered place for Cesar Chavez in the beginning of La Causa, um, we, we just we feel that spirit here and so we're going to be creating an assembly space that they can use, uh, La Causa can use it, Chicanos por la Causa can use it for various events, etc. But it also will uh, restore the, um, uh, we're going to preserve the one room for Cesar Chavez as a museum space for his uh, artifacts that were here when he was here. For more on historic preservation in the city of Phoenix, go to phoenix.gov slash pdd.